Hello YouTube, you can't see me right now, but that's because I'm behind the camera. I'm going to start trying to do something like weekly vlogs. Since I learned how to use YouTube's editing software, I can put little videos together. So this won't be up. So the date today is March the 5th? I want to say 5th, anyways. So this is everything that I'm putting in my swap with Miss Young Healthy. Anyways, and this, like I said, it won't be going up for a week. It should be in the mail by the time this goes up. But just in case the mail takes too long, I wanted to get, let, finally let her see what she's getting. Because I've been very sneaky sneaky about it. Anyways, I got this nail file from the Dollar Tree that I thought was really cute. I had gotten one that was skulls, but it's the same type of nail file. Um, you told me that you really liked... Um, colored eyeliner so I bought you four uh, you know you're getting this one because you bought it yourself and I just thought it was hilarious that I apparently knew your taste well enough to buy you something that you picked out for yourself the NYC eyeliner in paparazzi purple I bought one for myself too um, I bought you a Milani eyeliner in green at least I think it's green it was a green top, so I'm assuming it was green. I picked you up a glitter eyeliner in brown, and I picked you up a glitter eyeliner in silver. I've never tried these Milani eyeliners, so I hope they work out alright. I hope they don't suck. I picked you up this little cute journal from the Dollar Tree. Just a little extra. Here's one of the LA Colors things that I was talking about. Uh, I know you, she had told me that she hadn't had much luck with LA Colors, but I did pick her up two things. This is one of them that I bought for myself that I just really like the color and wanted to share it with her. It's the Treasure Island Nail Polish. Um, because some of the eyeshadow palettes that I bought you have colored eyeshadows in it, I picked you up a small angle brush. This is what I use to basically make my black eyeliner colored with the eyeshadow. Uh, you very likely probably had this brush, but I wanted to throw this in there to kind of show the idea that I had behind picking out some of the eyeshadows that I did. And hey, you can have more than one if you already have one. It's an awesome brush. I love it. I picked up three of the e.l.f. Hyper Shine lip glosses. God, this is probably another thing that you probably have. So I know you just did a huge e.l.f. haul, and I know you've done e.l.f. hauls before that. Uh, it's in Vixen. Berry Cherry? I'm reading through my viewfinder, sorry. And Bear. Uh, I love using this one to tone down a lip, a very dark or bright lip. I've never tried this one as of this filming, so I don't know how pigmented it is, but I really love this color too. This is, I said in my favorites video that I've been gravitating towards these two a lot, and this one will probably end up joining that gravitation. Here is the LA Colors lipstick that I was used to that I mentioned. It's one of my favorites. It is the Lip Gloss Lip Stick Duo in Pleasure. It's a corally color. I remember you saying that you really liked coral lips, so I figured you could try this. Let's see, I picked up, I have these as well, uh, two of the Sally Hansen Moisture Twists. This one, this is in uh, Sugar Sugar. It's the kind of nudie one. And this one is in Fusion something or other. Fuchsia Fusion. So just a really kind of bright pink, but they come out kind of sheer, so don't be too freaked out by the color. Uh, this is something that I've never tried before, but it's an Essence Silky Touch blush that I picked up while I was in Ulta that I thought was really pretty. I haven't opened it or swatched it or anything yet, so I hope it works. Uh, this was the nail color I was talking about in the Ulta haul that I never gravitate towards them, so I figured I'd throw it in for you, because I know you said you love nail polish. Uh, here's one of the eyeshadow things that I picked up. Um, I picked you up a Color Mates, like the one I'm using for my Project Pan, because I actually really like these eyeshadows. But I found one with a lot more neutrals in it for you. But it does it has still like the greens and the blues that you could use as eyeliner. Um, and this is everything I picked up from Big Lots, because I bought more for you than I bought myself. I picked up two of these little Almay quads, but I think they're technically trios because I think these are bases, like primer, basically. But it comes with the big color that's technically for your eyes, and then these two smaller colors for your crease and liner, but you can use them however you want. 
Here's the Bonnabelle eyeshadow quad that I picked up. I've used Bonnabelle before, and I they worked just fine for me, but I've never used this particular set. So I, like, I can't vouch for the blue, specifically. It looks really pretty, though. I almost picked one up for myself before I realized I don't need any more damn little eyeshadows like this. Um, but yeah, you could use this as a liner and then use the rest of these on your lid. I picked you up two of these CoverGirl Wet Slicks glosses that I really like. Um, I can't remember the color of these. Let's see. Guava Splash. And Berry Splash. Those are actually pretty true to color. But you could use these to tone down a like a darker lipstick or something. Or just wear them on their own. They're really pretty. Another thing that I haven't tried that I hope works. It's the L'Oreal One Sweep. It's a blush and bronzer duo. I have another thing that I didn't pick up for myself. But I hope it works out for you. And lastly, I have no idea if this will fit in your box or not. But I bought you a Ducky nail brush. So I picked up a blue one for myself and a pink one up for you. And like I said... I hope I can fit all this in the box. I might take like the glosses and the liners out of their packaging just so they can fit better. Because I mean, this actually comes pre-wrapped because when you could buy it in like CVS, you just bought the gloss and the little plastic wrapping. You didn't buy the box that was added by Dollar Tree. But like all of these will probably come out of their boxes. I'll leave this in the box just so that you could have the color name because LA Colors doesn't put their color names on anything. But yeah, that's everything I bought for you. I hope it all fits. Um, I might just say screw it and send it in a bigger box, even though we agreed to the small one. So that's it for now. Bye. So a friend of mine and my husband sent us a little care package that I was not expecting at all. He sent us a note saying, sorry for the rough luck. We hope this little bit helps. Ben and Claire and Benjamin Simmons. He sent Mo a toy. It's a little dragon that squeaks. Um, he actually had like scales and a tail, but we had to trim them off because immediately Mo was trying to eat them. So, and. He loves it. Right now he's trying to figure out what I'm doing, but he loves it. Uh, they also sent us a $25 Visa card and a $25 Chili's Macaroni Grill Maggiones, Maggi, Maggiano's and On the Border, which I think we only have a Chili's nearby, so that's what it'll be used for. They also sent us a cat toy, but Faust promptly knocked it under the couch, so we have to go find it. It's just a little wicker ball with feathers attached to it that has a little bell inside. So I just wanted to show that off real quick. So I got my first Ebates check-in. <laughs> Sorry, Mo is nosing around. And it was for $2.53, which made me laugh. I didn't think they actually sent out checks unless they were at least for $5, but I guess I was wrong. I, I just... It, I'm just showing that, yes, Ebates does work, but you gotta shop a lot to actually make any real money, I guess. Hi, YouTube. It, it, today is the 5th, and I'm still doing the vlog for a week thing. And it is too cold to get out of bed. <laughs> we got so much stuff to do today, and I just don't want to move. I managed to get out of bed for lunch. And then I came back in here to start getting ready, and Mo jumped on the bed, and he was just too inviting, and I just couldn't resist. And now we're both snuggled up in here, because it's freezing. Even though I have to go to the bank to deposit money, I need to go to the post office, I need to go to about eight other places, I'm sure. I have a list, and I have to clean, too. Oh, it's so comfortable. I don't want to get up. Come here, Mo. Come here. Don't fuss at me. Come here. I want to. I want you to see the camera. Mo's like, no, I was comfy. Come here. Ah! 
cleavage. Lots of cleavage. <laughs> yeah, Mo wasn't having it. He just wasn't having it. Oh well. I shall try to get up in a minute. So I did finally manage to get up and I wanted to film a quick outfit of the day. I am wearing my L'Oreal Colorish Lip Balm in Tender Mauve with the Elf Hyper Shine Lip Gloss and Bear over it. And as for my clothes, I'm wearing the necklace that my husband gave me. I'm wearing a blue shirt that was given to me by somebody. It was donated and it does zip. And my skirt is one that I actually thrifted, as are, I'm just going to lift it up and show you, my shoes. They're the little star ones. So that is it for this outfit of the day. Bye. Luke is officially killing me. It's Friday, and I woke up. And they had my favorite bomb palette for sale on Hope Look, and I definitely bought it. It was only 20 bucks, but still. Barking at me for, huh? What are you barking for? You just trying to say hello, or I want attention? No, you guys stay off of here. Oh, he's so bad. Our pets are part he's so bad. So fresher, less Look at that baby. <laughs> no, what you talking about? <laughs> what you talking about? Look at doggy. Who's my baby? Who's your baby? I just sent my package in the mail for Miss Young Healthier Anna. I hope I'm I'm hope I'm picking the right nickname. I'm, I don't know if you go by Anna or Stacy or Anastasia. Uh, two things didn't fit in the box, so I'm gonna be sending them separately. But just want to let you know your box is in the mail. <laughs> so I was just filming my project pan and the wiring and my bra broke while I was filming. <laughs> so I, I had this weird look on my face right when I realized I'm like, oh my god, my bra broke. Do I want to stop and change and get started again or do I just want to keep going? I kept going. I was really uncomfortable and guess who else was being a butt during the entire filming process? It's the mo. Was you cranky? <coughs> yes, he was very cranky. He could he could hear one of the dogs outside the door. Uh, since I got you here, do you want to see my outfit for the day? I went out tonight with my husband to dinner. It was our five-year anniversary, so I'm actually dressed up. Um, on my lips is the Revlon Just Kissable Balm Stain in Smitten. Along with my Buxom Lip Gloss and Zoe. I just happen to have them right here, so I figured I'd just show them too. Um, not much to say about my outfit. It's all donated. <laughs> so, like... This is my top. I'm just wearing a pair of black dress pants. And my boots were actually the ones that I thrifted. <laughs> I'm never any good at these outfit of the day things. Some people are so like moving cameras around and stuff and I'm just like, here's my boots. <laughs> Anyways, see you later. It's the end of a day on Saturday and I just wanted to say one thing. I finally beat my husband to a gift for our anniversary was yesterday and today I picked him up a Magic the Gathering starter set. It's a card game for those that don't know. Uh, he had an ass load of cards before and he's always, it's really hard to get him a gift because he always just goes and buys what he wants rather than wait for somebody to get it for him. It's time I beat him. I win. <laughs> We'll see you later. Bye, YouTube.